Welcome to Date with Danu, right here on High TV, your luxury channel. Today, the show is going to be really interesting because there's going to be fashion, beauty, and style. The three ladies I have, they are all powerhouses. Let's speak more on the show. Hi, I'm Ramani. Hi, I'm Sonali, and we're here to go on a date with Danu. Hey everyone, I'm Rosh and I'm here to go on a date with Danu. This is going to be interesting. So here I'm again to go on a date with Danu. I've done it, you know, a few times now. Well, I must say it's very interesting. At the same time, he puts you in a spot and you don't know how to answer them. So let's see what's going to happen today and uh, what questions he's going to ask us. I'm really not sure. I'm very nervous about it. I'm always nervous when I have to face a camera. So we'll see. Hope it'll be good. This is not the most comfortable thing for me. I hate cameras and I would like to kill Danu honestly for asking me again on this date. There can be a lot of other things we could do, especially because he loves, he thrives on taking people to bits in front of camera. Let's see what he has in store for us today. So I've known Danu for a really long time. Actually, we knew each other when we were in school and we used to sing together. So I used to see him, you know, he was in the Peter Roy Choir, I was in the Bridges Choir. Anyhow, lately, he's been very interested in my life and my husband. <laughs> he has a big crush on my husband actually and my husband will kill me now for saying this and um, yeah, Sultanu met my husband and now all he can talk about is about Ranga. So, it's going to be interesting. And welcome to the show. I have three ladies with me. Uh, I will start from that far corner. I have Rosh from Beauty by Rosh. Then I have Ramani Fernando from Ramani Fernando Salons. I have Sonali Dharmawardhana from Solani Dharmawardhana. God, you all don't have brand names. <laughs> we, we, we are brands. Yeah. Yeah. You all have just named your brands after you all and it's very hard to like, say anything after that. Um, Anyways, welcome to the show. I'm going to start with a foreign import. Um, <laughs> Beauty by Roche. I'm so proud of this brand. I told her this last time as well. Uh, especially, I had like I had this sense of pride when I saw her video appear on Colombo Fashion Week about how she created this brand and where it is today. And I was like, oh my God, this is like a girl who I used to know, uh, seeing her around on, saw her on stage. Then I have like associated with her but to see that she has made a brand and especially not here in Aussie and somehow penetrated it into so many different areas how was it in creating such a brand um, starting it was easier than going on with it uh, because starting it really like when I think of something and I want to do it I just do it yeah right um, and I think I mentioned this before because just starting it, I just started with whatever I can. I didn't make excuses saying I don't have the money, I don't have this, I don't have yeah. this whole team Even backing me Even if you had up. to sell it in a tin, you would have done it. Yes, yeah. just have to start, <laughs> yeah. right? And you never know where it goes. I had to see and then obviously people loved it. Then I created more yeah. and more and then yeah, it was really well received. But going forward, it is hard to keep that momentum going, mm. you know. So. Yeah. But how do you stay focused and inspired? I find that really easy to do because I'm very like I, I'm better when I have a task at hand. Like I'm I'm better when I'm focused. Otherwise I when I have nothing to do I kind of end up just I don't know, losing myself and I'll just watch Netflix and then I'm sad and I like nothing to do. Yeah. True. But I like when I'm busy yeah. and I've got something to do and I get excited and I'm really passionate about beauty, so that's amazing. Yeah. That's amazing. I'm telling you, her videos are worth watching. Some do it and they look grey, uh, just saying. <laughs> but anyway, coming to a person who really dislikes cameras, we have dressed the cameras like sunflowers and kept them here. <laughs> I'm happy to have Sonali. Hi, Sonali. Hi. And how are you? Are you feeling much better now that you started this? That I started this the show. Yeah. The show. Yeah. Definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is her second time on Date with Danu. I think the, this time she came only because Ramani Fernando said, come. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Correct? Hit the yeah. nail on the head. First, of course, she came and said, here, you're doing something, no? Then I was like, you're coming, no? I, I, didn't, I knew that I didn't have to like say another sentence after that because the magical words have been casted upon you. <laughs> yes. uh, how have you been? Your brand has been growing. Uh, your brand has become such a statement piece. When we see a Sonali, we know a Sonali. And that is a great achievement. How, how have the years been? Like I'm having you on a show after five years. Is it? Mm. 
Wow. Um, how have the years been? Great, considering that there's less camera. <laughs> but uh, the work has been growing because, like I think Rosh said, when you're passionate about something you do, I think it just keeps growing. So it has been good. In other news, Sonali has actually bought herself a pair of specs. Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> she used to rob other people's frames. <laughs> actually, specs yeah, because she can't it. see and if somebody leaves something back, she uses that. Thank uh, you, Dano. Yeah. This is wonderful, for, not for my brand <laughs> reputation, for my <laughs> reputation. <laughs> She is not a specs flicker. Uh, I must say she used one that was so old, the arms were like that, the nose pad was like that. I think they let it go because they were done with it. But she gave it life for another, what, 20 years, I think. Yes. <laughs> now my arms and legs are going that way, so the specs are looking better. <laughs> Uh, and we have the ever so gorgeous Ramani Fernando. I must say, please look at the shoes. <laughs> please lift a little bit to show the shoes. <laughs> it's Stana shoes, I'm telling you. Not about the shoes, the fact that you can stand on it. Like, what do you mean? You it's know, our ones, you know, like even my sister, when I tell her just wear heels for something, can't mind jaws are working, my nails are paining and things. Weird excuses. I'm like, beauty is pain, you have to suffer through it. Um, tell me, how do you always wake up you know I, I was actually today i was thinking you can never step out of the house like how i saw rosh in the morning <laughs> <laughs> or how you saw me yeah. you I looked like the homeless look at yeah the so i was we, we i looked very peely andala when i came today <laughs> <laughs> how you can never do the number one you're not in peely andala number two you can't have an off day right because ramani fernando looked bad is a statement that doesn't go down how, like, what time do you wake up and what time do you put yourself together? Ay, oh, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> Danu, you have not seen me in my house. I wear the most old clothes. I just, you know, actually. I can't tell you, picture that. No, no. <laughs> I'm telling you the truth, uh, okay? When I finish my morning session, my way of like, relaxing is really wearing my one of my old, you know, like, torn, like, a, like you know. Uh, like a nighty. <laughs> like a yeah, like a night you could uh, say. Okay. At least for an hour. Uh. It's, it really revives me then. Uh. And then I get back to my clothing. I just touch my makeup up. And then I come down to the salon in the afternoon. Because I need that little power nap. And right. like about two two hours in the house. Just you, you know? time. Yeah. So you haven't seen me like yes. So now you've seen me in those. <laughs> yeah. I really want to see you. And I'm going to come during your power nap just time. Come. Like, yeah. hey, no. No, I so came Nani, to see the 19. No, I've seen her. She's right. She'll wear something very comfortable. But the rest of her is still very poised. I think that's the point yeah, you're making. I mean, yeah. She cannot. She cannot. <laughs> yeah, it's look not anything. in a DNA. Yes. Yeah, I cannot. Even if I'm going to the uh, like toilet, supermarket. I'll go looking <laughs> for the toilet, right? Uh, what if I go to the supermarket even? I'm, I sort of I want to comb yeah, my hair and I won't get out of like, the house without like my hair being in place. Yeah, yeah. I don't. And if the makeup because is not done enough, the shades come on and they stay on, even if it's <laughs> pitch the, dark. And the mask. <laughs> mask. Yeah. <laughs> it's COVID every day. <laughs> Uh, all right, we have a we have a segment that I really like playing, and it's called Hot Seat. Should put them into trouble. Actually, um, Ramani has gone. I, have to, I feel so bad calling her Ramani because I call her Auntie Ramani always. Um, I have to uh, I have to put her through this once again. But you all, of course, deserve it. The two of you. All right, we'll see you with that. Welcome back to the show. And I have questions, so now I'm going to start with you. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you walk away with a gift bag from uh, Crystal Luxury Wellness. <laughs> Rohan or Ishan Delanoro? Who do you think looks better in your fabric? The two different individuals. Anna here, just tell me one person. Don't now go into this poetic no. Miss World answers. Tell me who. Who looks better in yeah. my fabric? Rohan. If you were not a designer yourself, a person you'd like to shop from? Indiapa, Amilani, Charini, Darshi. If I was not? A designer. Uh, Darshi because I like Patik. Okay. If you wake up as Ajay one morning, <laughs> what is the first and the last thing you'll do? That's a tough one. Mm, if I was Ajay, what would I do? Have makeup on my tatte 
<laughs> and make up on your third day. <laughs> okay. No, I actually don't know. What are you, tr what are you trying to get? What would you do as Ajay with your brain? Mm. Ah. Yes. Um, I would be looking at other, uh, other areas of design that can actually take CFW to another level. Which is If you fashion, ask him, he'll say it's at it. the other level. <laughs> <laughs> no, within fashion, uh -huh. but, um, sorry, within design, but out of fashion. Anything else? What, you, what would you do before you go to sleep? Um, strategize about. I'm happy that you're not RJ. Yes. <laughs> Describe Columbus society in one word. You really put me... You've done this to me before as well. Uh, in one word, false. True. But false is true. Yes. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> if you come across someone you did not like in public, you would ignore and walk away, give them a death stare, smile at them and fake it, scream and shout. Ignore and walk away. I've seen her doing it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Rosh, get ready. Those are really hard. You're, You're telling hard me. Things, no? Like, Ajay, I can't believe you asked me what I would do. What? So only I if hope you, you ask about people I know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> Out of the two ladies seated next to you, who do you think needs a complete set of Beauty by Rosh immediately? <laughs> I, I know that head stuff. <laughs> That, that's harder than what you asked. <laughs> Sonali. Sonali. Come on. Who? Okay, I'll give it to Sonali because Ramani already has everything. No, it's just, Sonali needs it. But <laughs> no, not but only Ramani she, has everything. Not Every only she needs everything. it, somebody needs to train. Oh, well. how do you <laughs> I will come to your house and train you. She'll just have the makeup and, and keep it. <laughs> uh, if you are to wake up one morning as Pumi Hansamali, what's the first and the last thing you'll do? First thing, I'll put on some clothes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Last thing. Last thing. You'll remove those clothes. <laughs> no, no, that she anyway does. So. She's very nice, I think. I've never met her. So, I yeah, mean, this fat. is very rude for yeah. me to say that. Last thing. Remove hmm. the makeup. Yeah, maybe just remove her makeup before she sleeps because definitely that's something she, everybody should do. Okay. Mm. Don't take hints from her to answer the question. Yeah, see, Rashid, we really are also... We are women, men, we have to support each other. Yeah. Very boring, like... Yeah. If you and Ramani were classmates, <laughs> what would you borrow from her and never give back? Her clothes. Her clothes. Good choice. I like your clothes. Not the nighty. Get the rest. Oh, yeah, not the other things. <laughs> yeah. Not the one she wears at home. All these things. Yeah. <laughs> if given an ultimatum, that you could say one thing before it disappears from the face of the earth. Forever, okay? Mm. What would you pick? Your husband, your makeup line. Then I can pick only one thing that I can just keep. Yeah. My husband. Good answer. If sex was the only currency available and you had to carry out a transaction, who from the following would you choose to transact oh with God. right now? Lasit Malinga, Charminga Karnaratna, Danu Inasitambi, Susantika Jaisingha. <laughs> By the way, uh, Charmika, I told him about you. He was at uh, Ramani's salon the other day and he liked like 100 pictures of yours, I think. I think I saw that. Yeah. I don't know who he is. He's a I know he's a cricketer, I realise. Yeah. He's the one who is like pleasant on the eyes these days. I'm not going to pick him now. <laughs> no, no, I'm just <laughs> saying. I'm show. just saying. Is it Lasit? Charmica. I'm not going to pick you. That will be like abusing you. You're not going <laughs> to... This is a hypothetical situation. I know, hypothetically, I, have to, I, have to I could be... Hypothetically, hypothetically, I could be like, you know, not the okay, way okay. I am. Okay, okay. <laughs> I, 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 I'll, I'll pick, I'll pick. I'll, I'll pick Lasit Maling. At one point, I thought he's have a school. He mm. looks like a lion. He's wild. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you'll have good grip. Your oh purchase God. will be... You know my us. husband's sitting right <laughs> behind these cameras too, <laughs> yeah. right? Like, I you're just trying to get rid of me and give me to Lassit so that you can have him. You yeah. can yeah. have Ranga, that's all. That's the plan. This man is that. wonderful, man. Her husband is He's just... the most 
precious man. I know. I feel he sorry is. because sometimes his face looks like devastated. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ramani. <Ayyo>. Ready. <laughs> if Beauty by Roche were in need of a brand ambassador, who from the following would you pick, ideally? Pushpika, Rosa Senanayaka, Corinne Almeida, Dalreen. Pushpika, Rosie, Corinne, Delry. Please pick someone nice. I know who you should pick. Um, <laughs> maybe Pushpika. Yeah, young, younger. <laughs> what is wrong with <laughs> you, Mommy? Why did you do that? <laughs> Rosie, then you want Rosie? Yes. What the gosh? You someone a bit. <laughs> uh, Ramani, you Ayyoh. can just, it's okay, we'll be partners, but don't do my marketing, okay? It's okay, I'll, I'll manage, I'll manage my marketing, it's fine. I thought you were the youngest of the lot, okay? I thought you were the young one. <laughs> it's good, it's good. Good, good. Yeah. She's yeah. beautiful. Okay, okay. She's makeup beautiful. can yeah, really yeah, yeah. do wonders yeah. now. Rosie oh has my God. God. <laughs> Your makeup can really do wonders. Look at what Good thing. Say. <laughs> Everyone's gonna hate us after this show. I know, gosh. <laughs> it's okay. Huh? I'm sorry. I was just talking about target audience, you know. Yeah, no, yeah, like, you know, yeah, that's all. Yeah. Nothing else. <laughs> so she's a rosy fan, right? Yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> no, it's okay. You tell your answer. Right, okay. right, done. A salon you think could use a bit of a Ramani touch? Uh -huh. Capello, Jal, Ramsey, Shagal. Are you asking yeah, me? What is this man? This is a little Ramani touch. So Kepolo has it. <laughs> because, uh, because Ramesh has been working with me for years. They can do with it now. A little Ramani touch. The like just imagine you're a fairy godmother, you go and sprinkle uh, some Ramani. I hope. Come <laughs> on, man. <laughs> Who so? There's Shagal, Ramsey, Jal, Kapilo. You know, nowadays, oh, yeah, at 5,000 rupees, you can get someone bumped off. <laughs> What are you after this, <laughs> after this show, you yeah. know, there will be those people who just give I'll you that the dead stare and she's, leave. I okay, she's the one who's like, trying to kill me. Yes, you're right. I don't think they need a Ramani touch. They're okay. doing fine and they're happy in their own way. They might think Ramani touch is very old fashioned. Uh -huh. there, so. If you had to pick a man to represent Sri Lanka for Miss Sri Lanka, because we have done that as well, who would you pick that you think will look fabulous in a dress? Shalin Balasuriya, Harin Fernando, Iraj Viratna, Namal Rajpaksa. Say, say it again, the names? In a dress. Shalin okay. Balasuriya, Harin Fernando, Iraj Viraratna, Namal Rajapaksa. <laughs> she looked at Sonali for comfort. Sonali <laughs> 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 keeps giving answers to everyone. Like, 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 Shalin. Shalin. Yeah. Shalin. Yeah. Hmm. One thing you love and one thing you hate about your husband, Ranjit. Oh, Ali. It can be, man. <laughs> <laughs> Must I answer that? Just one thing you love at least? Yes. I, I love everything about him. Oh, no. yesterday, yesterday, 52 years of marriage. Oh, my anniversary yesterday. Wow, okay. I think Ayu, you that's, need to that's, give her that's a blessing. Yes, that's amazing. Oh, no, that's so wonderful. Blessing. So then, what? No, what, what do you want that, to that say? Is ever, yeah, that, yeah. For, that you know. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is that one order that you absolutely cannot stand when they walk into the salon? Armpit, bad oh. breath, toe jam. Jesus. All no, three no. are horrible. <laughs> okay, all three are as bad as each other, right? Yeah. What do you do when you. Thank God, you know, you used to talk about this. Yeah. When you used to wear the mask, yeah. right? It is to like prevent that, no? Yeah. Uh, the salons. I mean, at least a mouth order. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> and also, we don't get anyone's order when yeah, you're wearing that. Is, yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So yeah. that was. All three are really bad. Put a mask on it all. <laughs> yeah. Well done. I must say congratulations to... I must say it's Rosh who won it. <laughs> <laughs> and also for the fact of answering Romney's question. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into a break. We'll see you right after. <laughs> Welcome back to the show. I'm telling you, I'm having too much of a good time on this show. 
So Nali, let's her come back. Okay, why is she scared? <laughs> She's just so scared. Yes. Uh, so Nali, I know that you, it was a sad day for me to see your store closed, but your collections are still out there. It's hard, right, to run a store these days. It's expensive. My store is not closed. <laughs> No, your store here at Park Street. Park Street, okay, yes. But now you have it at your own place, but at the same yes. time you're retailing at many places. It's hard, right, to run a place? Yes, it is. Yeah. It is a challenge. Because it's not easy, like, how much can you explain to your client? You know, you can't sell it at a premium price and charge over that. How was it for you when you had to, like, break into this world of fashion? Because not only the fact that you design amazing clothing, but it's also curated to a set of people, because not everyone could... They're not in that purchasing power. Uh, sometimes do you feel like, I need to always maintain my quality and my style and never go a bit lower and jeopardise what my creativity is about? Have you ever thought of that? I think that's how I work, because if I go to um, do multiple numbers, which might make it actually more affordable in a sense. And also you'll easy for you as well in, on your wallet. Yes, because that means I can have the artisans do it and not do it personally. Mm. Um, yes, but then I lose the whole the identity of yeah. my brand. Because there's always a Sonali piece and you know that you are never going to see another. Um, have you ever done a piece where you're like, I just don't want to let this go? Many times I feel that. And have you ever kept those pieces back? or you? No, I haven't. You, there is somebody who loves it a little bit more than you. Yes. Or you convincing be. Pave is better. That's what you need to do when you're actually doing a brand, isn't it? An artist. Mm. I think you are, a, you are first an artist and then a designer. Definitely. Yeah, because I'll never forget this piece that she made long years ago. I was way thinner. Yes, um, way thinner. Now, you didn't have to elaborate on that statement. <laughs> um, this was this dragon that was draped on six yards across and it looks like a woman has been just captured by this dragon and this fire flame just throws out at the headpiece. Where is that sari? I don't know. I think someone who lives in Italy owns it. You should it. get it and frame the six yards because it was all hand done mm. and that time you were the only one doing it. Yes. You had nobody to even like help, help <laughs> or even melt the wax for you. <laughs> like yes. I would have never let that piece go. It was just absolutely gorgeous. Have you ever thought of recreating it? Even if you recreate it, there's going to be a change. No? Yes, there will always be a The dragon change. might lose a bit weight or mm. <laughs> yeah. have some kind of a look. Lose come. weight, unlike some dragons who have gained weight. <laughs> yeah. Ane, please remove the sunflowers off the camera. <laughs> uh, Rosh, this partnership with Romani Fernando Salons to sell your makeup and uh, you told me a wonderful process about it. Uh, tell me about the process. So many would think that Ramani and I have been friends for a long time, but we haven't. But we're good friends now. <laughs> um, we met just before CFW, I think because of CFW, um, because her partnership with CFW for 20 years, and yeah. then I came on the last two years. So that's when I met, got to know Ramani. I've been to her salon so many times mm. over the years as I was a kid with my mom also. Uh, because, you know, we were such salon goers. <laughs> <laughs> so we used to go to Cinnamon Grand and Hilton all the time, even back then. Uh, but I never really knew Ramani. You know, I knew of her. Yeah. Looked up to her, but I never knew her. But, um, yeah, so we got to know each other. And then uh, she came to Perth. Yeah. We hung out. That's, mm. when you first that was the first time we met. We met right. in Perth. Right. We went right. to Crown. We hung out. And it was just instantaneous, I guess. We were <laughs> friends. And then, um, yeah, and then I came, once we did CFW without me here. Right. Uh, this year, we ca I came to CFW and we spent a lot more time together. And we've been spending a lot more time ever since. That's amazing. Now, uh, as you know, the salon industry, the beauty industry is constantly growing. And, uh, but the brand name called Romani Fernando has stood through all of this. What do you say is the formula that you have used or what you practice that keeps it going? It's a question that's asked from me often. Who are these other people who ask <laughs> me? Oh. <laughs> everybody, everybody asks this, yeah. So it's like this, uh, Dano. I think the passion I have for it still, you know, I look forward to my day's work. I'm excited about the days. You know, lots of challenges, though. You know, I'm dealing with so many people, especially my staff, mm. young staff. You know, it's not easy. But I somehow, somehow get through it, you know. And... Um, 
I just simply enjoy what I'm doing, you know. If there's a fashion show coming up, I'm still excited about it. You know, mm. I wouldn't know what to do if I don't have that kind of thing. Right. So, it's, I think it's just that. Is and that the, a I little... think the staff sees that passion in me, you know. I, I try to, you know, see into details about everything. Mm. It's very hard, but they might not see it like that. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. That's but is that a little tyrant in you that we don't know about? There may be, yeah. I suppose that you have to ask the staff. Uh, but you know something? This is something that r the wrong thing I do, really. I just hate to go to the salon and see things not right and blah. I really lose it then, you know? I just blast them, <laughs> right? So I want the peace and I want them also to be happy and all that. So I always tell them that I'm coming, you know? I and then inform, they get informed. Then they're all like dolls <laughs> and the place is good. And I, 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 I'm not saying it's not like that all the time, but I suppose they take that yeah, extra care when they know I'm coming. So this is something that I want to always, you know, do spot uh, checks. Yeah. I want to do this. Today my hair was done, redone, redone, done, done. Ah. They're like, Ramani, you know any other show? Make yeah, make it perfect. Make it stand the way it's supposed to. But and it's amazing. And also, I must say that if there are any complaints, there are complaints, you know, dealing with so many people. From the, yeah. So I take it up 99% personally. I'll talk to them and, you know, I think that also goes a long way. People forgive you for that and, you know, I just come back, give something complimentary. Yeah. You know, that I think goes a long and way. And also people need to understand this is still a skill that is done by humans. And yeah. error is yeah. possible. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. We have a game called Yes or No, and that's what's coming up next. Oh. All right, we have a very interesting game, and this is made possible by our friends at Dialogue Power Plan. I must say, the best mobile postpaid plan ever. We have such great deals with them, you don't want to miss out, and I'll tell you all about it right after this game, because this is super cool. All right. Just be honest and show the side that matches the answer. Here we go. Never have I ever peeped into a stranger's YouTube. Peeped? Yeah, like checked out. Gone and searched their search results. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> stranger's YouTube. Don't we think always so. watch strangers. No? No, not strangers. Then? Like check their search bars and things like that. Ah. Oh. No. no. You? I also don't know how you to also do don't know. My God. Good, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never have I ever left missed calls without returning. Several. Yeah, you better hold that yes and wait for another <laughs> 10 minutes. <laughs> yes, I don't think yes, you even yes. know where your phone is now <laughs> that we have put a dog chain on it. It's yes. <laughs> huh? It's yes. We all have. Really? But. Uh, no, I'm, I'm bad. Ah, okay, so, Sonali is very Sonali bad. sometimes Sonali buries the phone. Yeah. She never answers the phone. Yeah. Sonali doesn't know that she owns a phone yeah. at times. <laughs> She's like, what is that Something, repeat there's this, noise? There's that's a hum. Yes. <laughs> now she has a huge dog chain put to this phone. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> attached. Uh, attached. To me. But not so yet not reachable. <laughs> Never have I ever binge watched an entire TV series in one day. Boring. Yeah. <laughs> have you ever broken wind in public and blamed it on someone else? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> blamed it on someone else. Yeah, at least just broken wind. We are all lovely course, ladies. Shall we beings. all not answer? So just that. say yes or so no. So just say. Yes. Maybe yes. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Human, I'm yeah. telling you, <laughs> you know, I have yeah. constant gastric issues. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. You don't even have to well, answer that. I was in Candy recently and I was walking down this corridor. There was nobody. It was like 12 30 in the morning. I told my sister, if I, had, if I could have put a trumpet there, it would have been an orchestra. Uh. <laughs> oh <laughs> <my> <laughs> God. There's a lingering remains of me there. Oh God. <laughs> yeah. Too honest I am on this show. Yes. Mm. Never have I ever used someone else's phone to talk, stalk someone on Facebook. No, I know. No. no. Yeah, I knew. <laughs> <laughs> My husband, he's poor Facebook. <laughs> Would you choose to save your child over your spouse if forced to make a decision? 
who made yes. these questions it's okay just answer i don't have a child that is true <laughs> dog i oh, no i have andy <laughs> yeah. i love andy so andy is your child he's my everything yeah I have to lose Ranga, <laughs> <laughs> but I need them both. I can't. You can I always can't find another that. Ranga. No, 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 no! I can't. I can't find another Ranga, and I can't find another Andy. So I can't. I'll just go. <laughs> You'll be the one who's yeah. there. Fine, we'll skip that question. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> have you ever bullied someone? You? <laughs> this you one? Have. I really, have. I can't I imagine. No, you have a real like saint look I about know. you. Oh, Only thank you. Thank you. That she <laughs> might be representing the false part of Colombo. <laughs> 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 you have bullied me, Sonali. Put I that yes. I bullied my brother as well. Put the yes sign. Yes. <laughs> Do you believe there's good in everyone? Yes. Yes. Ah no! I sadly thought of one or two people. No, <laughs> I I don't. I I don't believe that. There are so some who are just. This one is I don't know. She just wants to sit right my next to Peter. I think. My ex-husband has nothing good in him. So <laughs> the gate. Yeah. yeah. You know, I was saying my ex-husband. He has nothing good in him. So I have to say no. Actually, you know, I forgot that she had an ex-husband Every, uh, until like yesterday. Everybody has forgotten night. him. So until it's last night, I was saying, ah, oh, this one. Ah, oh, this <laughs> one was that one. Then I was like, whoa, okay. We'll talk about that when we do come back. Oh. But I have to tell you now. Listen to this, okay? I just have to inform you all about this because you know, dialogue is on the show with mm -hmm. us with Power Plan. Do you know that you have something called data rollover now? Especially y'all, <laughs> may not be using all the data for the month, yes. and y'all are just paying and paying and yes. paying. Annoying, no? But here you get a chance to roll it over for the next month and save your bucks. Wow. I know. I think I should just rob your phone and start yes. using it. Now these plans also include 50 GB of data, which you can share with your loved ones. All these and more, of course, with Dialog Power Plan. All you have to do is just log on to www.dialog.lk or just get on to my Dialog app, Dialog Sri Lanka's number one network. We're getting to a break. We'll see you on the other side. Do stick around. It's a day for Zani. Welcome back to the show. Celebrating 50 year, 52 years married is definitely a gift. And I'm so happy that more, many more years of joy, peace, and lots of love. That's what I wish upon you. Uh, but you know, finding a partnership, a friendship, and also a union that is so complementary to each other is very hard. Uh, I think that is a gift. And also, it takes two sides. You have to work on it. You can't just be like, you know, he sneezes too loud, or when she pees, I can hear it and walk out. You know. There, there, there have been moments like that, um, but you know, sometimes it's very hard. You're forced to live with somebody under one roof, and it can really annoy you. Uh, but y you came out of a marriage and found somebody who really compliments you. But at that particular point, when you were in it, when it was toxic, you never knew it was. No. When you're too close to it, you can't really see it. Because you are an outspoken girl, you have your own decision, you are very headstrong, but somebody like you, they'll be like, oh my God, Rosh the girl, I. But it was not like that, right? No, not at all. Like I think everyone's so surprised that I was in an abusive relationship. Like, why would you stay? Like, mm. but you're so bubbly and you're so outspoken. But you, like, you know, it won't happen to you. That is true. But until you're in those situations, you can't judge what people will do, right? Like, and you're a manipulator. You're young. It's very hard to see it until you're outside. And, and looking it, in, yeah. yeah, then you can see everything. What made you take the decision? This is it. It's done. I didn't. <laughs> he left me. Huh. But I mean, Good. now looking back, I'm like, my God. Th thank you. Th thank you. Like, it was the best thing that ever happened to me. Yeah. But I would have never left. I was very loyal and mm. just there you know i would have always stayed but also you love unconditionally yes. you know? you're like big in your hugs you're yes. warm and yes it's it and it breaks you when you're especially a person like that when you give so much and what you're getting is just yes. like ice cold yeah. yeah yeah and i realized after i got out that i never had love like it was so sad and mm. now I, I i mean i got so lucky that is true like it is a partnership, like yeah. you say. You know, it is a friendship. He's your best friend, you know. Right and now, Ranga is in an abusive relationship. Power? <laughs> no, he's not. No, he's not. He won't tell that. Yeah. He, he, he is lovely. So I 
you know, when I found that and, you know, we started dating and stuff, I realized that and my standards were higher because I learned Correct. from my earlier. And taller as well. <laughs> yes. uh, yes. He is taller <laughs> and <Disney>. stronger. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> now we are just going like oh, off yeah, topic. Yeah. Like, uh, I thought you'll really like Ani, it. <laughs> very shy I am. I don't know anything. Of course, of course. <laughs> She's telling me I will find it and cut it off. This one. What? Oh like, it's, it's all what at the same place. Is? Mine is not a fixed here on my forehead to search for it. Oh God. <laughs> so I'm Sonali, now I've known Sonali for a long time, way before her time as a designer. She was into uh, creating fabric that used to make even chairs at home look amazing. Um, Sonali, you have a daughter. Yes. And she's like a diva now. I can't imagine she was like this, like a bowling. And now she has grown out to be so, so, like, you know, different. So different and such a personality about her. Becoming a mother, leave alone your other things in life, how did that sort of change you as a person? Because that's the time when you go from being Sonali and then you become Sonali with a purpose. That's mm. like your biggest purpose. Yes, that's true. That is true. Um, I think uh, it changed a lot of things in me. I'm, I'm a very um, headstrong person and uh, I'm the elder of the two uh, children in my family. So I am quite uh, bossy with my brother. You Bully know him, I still that. do. Yes. We know. Um, <laughs> so I think because he was much younger, he was I, I always looked at him as my, like a offspring. Uh, but when I had Sharana, you realize you become more accountable, responsible and all of that. So there was a short time I was raising her on my own, though her dad was overseas mm. and he used to be very much available to her mm. in her life. But you all kept that union of parents still going for her. Yeah. All throughout. And I think that's something that you learn, that when you have a child and even though you might have grown apart, that it's essentially important that people understand that you can't be selfish and you have to be responsible for the other person. That person requires both people that's true. and you need to respect both. So you might not want uh, or like certain things about the other person because you've grown apart, but you learn to value it for the sake of the child. Mm -hmm. So I think Sharanya uh, made me a better human being. Amazing. Um, Ramani Fernando, <laughs> uh, it's one thing to stay married, but you know, there's a sense of attraction, there's a sense of lust, all of this that fades off and eventually it becomes companionship. Like you're knowing that there's a shadow there that will always be there for you. How do you keep that going even today? How do you find that? I have, I have been fortunate enough to witness one day when they had dinner when I had dinner with them, and how sweet she was. Ranjit, shall I bring that closer, put this chair a bit closer? <laughs> Just constantly knowing where there could be a gap. But that kind of, that kind of foil that you all create, when, did, when do you think that change happens in your life? Well, <coughs> Tanu, I met him when, he was, when I was 17. I got married to him before I was 19. So, Child abuse. Yeah, so, you know, like all my life, and I actually grew up with him kind of thing. Mm. You know, 17 at that time, like, yeah. you're so naive, you're not even exposed, you're not gone out. And your upper you lip know? was also not done. Nothing done. Yeah. Yeah. Under arms. <laughs> <Not that. laughs> so, anyway, so you grow with him, and then, so as you say, as you go on in, in, in years, it's like... Uh, it's a kind of, I don't think of it like that. Yeah, maybe that, that love, love thing is like, I of mean, course. it, it, it fades, fades away, yeah. right? It's, you know, diff it's a different type yeah, of love. Yeah, it's a companion. Yeah, like he cares about me so much still and mm -hmm. I care about him. And so it's, it's like that. I don't think of it like, you know, uh, there's no excitement or whatever oh, yeah. like that. You know what True. I mean? But... Uh, you never know, but the 90 must be, mm, <laughs> she has come for a one hour break. <laughs> Ramani is in that very, uh, very casual 90. <laughs> yeah. So it's like that, you don't, uh, just how you look at it and 
basically is very kind, you know, mm. and then he gets angry and yeah. irritable and all that. <laughs> but I know, because I'm still working, uh, yeah. if you're going to be with somebody like 24-7, 24/7, I think that's not possible. That is you know, true. Not that it's not possible, it's hard. Yeah. Okay. But because I, you know, I go out to work and I come back and now he's, you know, there was a time he used to travel so much and he was hardly at home. Yeah. So I used to do my own thing, like, yeah. you know, and so we had an understanding like that. And now it's other way around. You know? That's true. Yeah. Well, that's great. I'm going to call this 90 look the Pamano look. <laughs> Worse than Pamano. Ah, really? Oh, God, we have pushed it beyond levels. Maybe she has seen me in those. <laughs> <laughs> we have a fun segment. So, Nandi, you're going to love it. Oh it's called God. Kinky. Here is your question. And if you answer it well, as I'm the love guruji, I shall choose a winner and give this box of goodies from Midnight Divas. Oh, my God. Adding Smash. color to Palmanua. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. All right, here we go. <laughs> here we go. What's the most extreme thing you have done in the bedroom? Oh my God. Sorry. Answer it. That is going to make me answer. <laughs> Those are things I can't Honey, say on just camera. Something. No, it's okay. Huh? Yeah, those are things I can't say on camera. Have you been tied? Maybe. Huh? <laughs> By this Ranga? <laughs> Ane, I think he has been tied. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Maybe it was the other way around. I know yeah. that poor man looks abused, man. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Sonali? What? <laughs> she has no comment. I got scared with her. But <laughs> <laughs> what is the most extreme thing that you have done in the bedroom? Taken my glasses off. Wow, <laughs> what a start. <laughs> it's the blur vision that keeps it going. Yes. <laughs> I can't see anything. Step Let's one. get on with it. <laughs> I think that's what I need to go for as well. Yeah. I should remove my specs and everyone will look good. That's right. <laughs> yeah, that's what I need to go. I've skipped Ramani Fernando. No, oh, okay. he, he can't. Okay. <laughs> Have you ever speaking. been intimate? I know that you can't answer this. Have you ever been intimate with someone a lot older or younger than you? you give. Mm. <laughs> That's my yeah. seductive look. Mm. No wonder I'm still single. <laughs> no. No. Um, no. So Nali? No. You mean like 10 years older than us? Some things no. are older than you, younger yeah. than you. So they are so it has to be a lot older. older. No. Yeah. You're so saying extreme. Like, yeah, like you? four or no. five is okay. not a lot, no. no. Five no. years old is not a lot. So 10. But it is a lot if you're like 20. Ah. Oh, no. ah. Then yes. Oh. Like when I'm very young? Yeah. Huh? How young? Again, this is on camera, so let's... You're not abused, no? No, no. Oh, <laughs> wild. When oh. you're young. Not so wild. Look at Auntie Ramani, she has just gone into... She's like, I'm just, <laughs> just, let me just... I'm just thinking about like <laughs> roses and You know clouds. what, I'm just going to give it to the three of you. Share it. Yeah, share it. <laughs> Choose what... You might need and take it. Oh, but we <laughs> might need. Yeah. There are things that can really just do the job without you wasting your time. Oh, Let's go into a break. We'll see you after. <laughs> mm -hmm. Welcome back to the show. Let's get into Dish the Dirt. Welcome back. I'm going to start off with this thing. When, you're, when, you, when you don't fall into a framework that society gives you, you are seen as the odd one out. You're easy to be called like names, isolated, moved aside. Uh, but you tend to learn so much in that point that you grow and become bigger than that box that society has given you. Uh, I think, Rosh, you fall into one of those you didn't fall into the framework that the society wanted you at that time. How was it when you blossomed and when you found your own place and when your mates, your friends saw you? It's easier now. It was really hard growing up because when you're different, when you're growing up, it's hard, yeah. especially growing up in Sri Lanka because I think you get more cornered and bullied when you're a bit more outspoken or different or just breaking 
the norms. And you're judged by the same syllabus. Yes. You're judged by the 100 marks you'll get. Correct. Yeah. And like there's only one framework to be good at something, right? And like, but I think my parents really encouraged me to be me as to why I just turned out to be me. Because mm. my mom and dad, like they, yeah. they were very different thinkers and that's why I got to be me. And now, now I've really like gotten into who really I am and I unapologetically am what I am and mm. it is what you see and I'm very open-minded and I'm also very outspoken mm. but I'm also very like raw like I'd say I, I don't really have a filter as yeah. much and I don't really... No, that's why I like you. <laughs> <laughs> Filters are boring, nice for pictures, that's it. <laughs> uh, Sonali, even you like you might have been the let's say oh, Sonali, anyway, you know, no, Sonali mm. but in your family, in in this whole framework of your uh, relatives and all, Sonali Dharma Vardhana has become such a name that they have to deal with. It's everywhere. People wear you, people are proud to say you, they'll tag you. What is their take on you? To them, I'm just the sister, the daughter, the niece. Or they don't give a tosh about all of that. Are you? <laughs> really? I mean, I think they are proud of whatever I achieve yeah, and they'll be there. You know, Sri Lankans don't show it, no? Yeah. They're like, mm-hmm, hari, hari, hati, then. None of those. No, no, not, not in that way, though, no. I think they are, but um, they, how can you have airs and uh, anything about you when it's your home and your people, no? So, mm -hmm. it's not like that. Was that what you were asking? No, no, it's okay, but that's what you feel, that's why. Yeah. Have all your members in your closest circles supported your journey? Yes, always. I think. Wasn't uh, there a few who ever doubted you? The, in my circle? Oh, yes. The circle I've that you're born into, which we have no choice. Well, the circle I was born into, um, I had a lot of support from. But there were people still, there are some in your inner circle mm. who have not been very receptive about what you do. Yes, I have had that. Auntie Ramani, you are a grandma, a mum. Uh, having them all going to school, asking them to do what they like. Uh, you know, I always say mothering people. I love it. <laughs> However much I struggle to do my math, my mum will only tell me one thing. Do whatever you can. And I didn't care what the teachers or the principal or the rector will say of a school. Because my mum had given me that understanding statement. End of the day, that's what matters. How was it bringing up your kids and letting them find themselves? Uh, yeah, we left it to them to find themselves. And uh, I must say, like, bringing up children at that time, I, I got really very, very busy when the kids were young, mm. you know. Now I'm more relaxed. That's the time I... Business was your, growing and yeah. then Ranjit was out a lot. So it was not easy, but I had my mom who used to help me, Ranjit's mom used to help me, my elder sister to help me. Mm. So like, you know, I had always a support. And um, one, another thing is at that time, you know, we didn't have social life much. No? Correct. And Ranjit was away and I, you know, we didn't have this kind of social life mm. at the time. So in the evenings after work, what I do is I'm with the kids. You right. know, and then I had my business in the house. So when they come come after school, I'm there for them. Yeah. So in my own way, I sort of uh, you know managed that that mm. way. So that was not bad really. You know, but mm. sometimes I still had that guilt feeling in me. You know, I could have done better when I see these young mothers now how much they do for their kids. So I I feel that at times, but uh, I did my best with yeah, uh, what I could have. Yeah. And they're all what they are and who they are because you have such a major part in them and uh, it's it's not easy to stay that way from there we're getting to a break we'll see you right after that to stick to we did some digging on their social media i must tell you sonali's is just very dry done the digging now to show look at this you look a million buck oh and darling yes and it ran stunning it no it's not long ago yeah because i've showed no last time i showed all your old pictures 
I thought we'll show you fresh. Gorgeous. Stunning, no? Really nice. yeah. yeah. Very, very nice. You want to see? All of these are kept together. Stress. Now let's look at this. Look at this bombshell. Oh. You're not yeah. supposed to look at the picture and say, oh, tell me a story about it. So. What is the story? I nice have my hair lovely. cut short. Yeah, yeah where, where was this? Go back. <laughs> cool. Not where was this the picture. taken? Yeah. Um, I think I've just come back from an overseas trip. And she's thrilled to see me. <laughs> right, thank you. I spotted you from a mile away. Oh, God. Who are these girls with bad hair? <laughs> bad hair. We are all having yeah. that. We are like the Bay City Rollers or the Bee Gees, <laughs> <laughs> whatever. All have the same. Yeah, terrible. <laughs> it's like you all are part of like a, and will you, will like you believe, a military group. <laughs> but will you believe that all of these, we still meet and oh, we're really? still friends? Uh, who are these people? My classmates. Ah, right. And that's inside the... You're the only one who's in blue. The rest are all in white. Is it? Mm. Horrible picture though. <sighs> oh. Rosh is multi-talented singing, wow. dancing. What is this moment here? That was about 2007. Wow. <laughs> yeah, she's a dancer as well. Look at her. Look hot. <laughs> Fabulous. That's the time I used to know her. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She's all lady Going like. For ballet. Cute So cute. Those Which are my neighbors. Huh? And yeah, two neighbors and one best friend from uh, since I was in grade one. So the what are the neighbors doing now? <laughs> one is in England. Uh, one's here. Lovely. We grew up together, all of them. Oh, that's our wedding. Uh, I must say this belt look was not in at that time when you did it. No, it was. Oh, really? I just, just wanted, wanted to, give to you cinch my waist when that's I the only give part that's small. <laughs> <laughs> so you have to give that shape. Yeah, that so. is true. Tell me about the wedding. Where did it happen? It was in Santorini. Mm. We flew and our friends came and yeah, it was beautiful during sunset. Lovely. Beautiful. Lovely. I wore batik sari. Yeah. Nice. Sonali. Um, this one is from Darshi. Very nice. Lovely. Beautiful. I must picture. say that you have come very far in life, Rosh. Look at this. <laughs> that was when we were in school. We went to KFC. Me and, and Tara. And you ended up, what, you got drunk? This was not one of the times that Tara and I got drunk, but <laughs> this is during the day. I, mean, I think that's cute. <laughs> and also, I must say, I'm happy that you. Thank you. You have developed your skill. Yes, I have. Practice makes perfect. Uh, it does. I, I wanted to see like, I wanted to see like the old Rosh that makeup. That was a really look. old picture. I know. Yeah. Look at this cold cucumber. Oh God! I oh, to see. oh, did you see that? Red. Where are you peddling after you didn't pedal? No, you just used it as a prop. <laughs> this is some delivery bike, I think. <laughs> oh God. That was in Rome. <laughs> Now, oh, sorry, so. Oh, those are my parents. <laughs> I read a post that it said, I just wish I can turn back time right now. Now. Was that a moment that you... He's, because he's 90 and she's 79. And yes, I wish, really wish. That's sweet. Uh, <laughs> oh. These are like some stunning... Profile pictures, oh. actually. Roshni has pictures for me to look at. <laughs> Unlike the rest of yeah, us. Yeah, you all are just. No, but how can you say Raman? This is picture. like and, and it just stunning <laughs> picture. <laughs> Delivery time in Rome. Yeah. Stunning Please. picture. Yes, that's a nice. The lucky thing. bloody cat. Are you a cat? Is no more. Are you sorry? Anne. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's Anne. remember the cat as well. Yeah, this oh. one who was got knocked down by a car. Huh? Aww. <laughs> he watches all the shows. He gives me comments and he'll Aww. always follow up when the trailer is out. Very social active. Anyway, this is the look that. Uh, this, uh, Street art. This is the look that Ramani goes for when she's not in the mood to dress the full 
look up. Fashion week, right? I yeah. thought that would have been because of the odor. <laughs> <laughs> Everything together. <laughs> just the uh, scenario. Uh, she just wants to see the rest. I don't show the like. This is, <laughs> <laughs> the rest are just. <laughs> Whatever. Rush, this is yours. <laughs> oh. And there's around. And that's mine. Ah, ah, see, that's the one she liked. Ah, sorry. Show, show, show. It's nice. I love the show, suit. Show, show, show. Show now, show now. You have no choice. <laughs> and and this is Ranga's birthday. Ah, really? Right? How? <laughs> sorry. This is Ranga's birthday. <laughs> we went to Nobu. Right, Ranga, okay. you've got your time there. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, thank you for being here. Am I, am I done with this show? I am done with the show. All right. Uh, thank you for being here, ladies. Uh, I must say, I, I really do love yours company. Although Sonali has just let me down tremendously, this pocket was to be filled with one of her creations. It will be done. Today. 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 Yeah. She's going to go back home This now. is what yeah, she's yeah, going for. I told her, you know, just give me those cut pieces. You know, those saris that she's making. Out of six yards, she can give me a small piece like that. Yeah, no? yeah. yeah. And let, let the customer <laughs> have five yards. <laughs> have one little patch <laughs> piece. <Missing. laughs> Sorry, Danu has that patch. <laughs> but I must say, uh, Roshni, your mum will be so proud of what you have become. I know you're very close to her. And uh, one of the brands are named after her. Her lipstick, lipstick. Marjorie, yeah. There you go, but she must be so proud of your journey, and I'm so happy that you have blossomed into this amazing person. I told you this last time, and I'll Thank say you. it again. I'm Thank very you. proud of everything that you have achieved, and it's it's great to see people thrive with such a positive vibe about them, and also collecting people around them and uplifting them as well. That is what matters, not about just going on this journey. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Well, Auntie Ramani, you know how much I love you. And uh, you'll love always you be special to me. And y you are amazing. And I'm so happy that I get to do another show with you. So, Nali, I love you always. We have known each other for a long time. She knows my family as well. Little bit, like. Not a lot. Little bit. Um, but, you know, it's been a long time since I've owned a piece from Sonali. Oh. Now you were buttering me up. Please leave it like that and don't lace it with anything so that I'll want to kill you after. <laughs> On that note, we need to wrap things up. We will see you soon with another cool episode of Date with Dan. Until then, you keep smiling. It's right.